Hey, it is Sharice, and I just wanted to say there is no way that I'm not going to hop on here and just give you a little bit of encouragement. Um, I was praying this morning and um, God is just, I'm going to tell you personally, God has been just taking me through a very specific season that I know he is developing something within me. And I'm going to be honest with you, it hurts. Um, there are things that God has um really pointed out that I needed to remove from my life. And there are things that God has also pointed out that I need to do. Um, and it's tough. It's, it's hard. And, and I wanted to encourage you with the fact that God knows what is best for you, regardless of what plans you think you have for yourself or for your life. Um, I think there's a proverb that says a man pl plans its way, plans his way, but the answer is from the Lord. Like God is the one who directs our steps. Um, and I just wanted to remind you um, and just encourage you with that. There is something that God wants you to do in your life. And sometimes that means sacrificing things that you think <laughs> you need to be doing or you think you know, other people are expecting you to do instead of just clearing out all of the noise and sitting and being still with God. That is a thing that I'm trying to learn. And I believe that God is really, really graciously um, teaching me in this season. And I'm not going to lie. It humbles me because I really like to think that I know what I'm doing in every area of my life and I know how it's going to pan out and I, I I get really analytical about things and I'm, I'm more on the logical side and God is like, hey, I need to talk to you. <laughs> I need you to sit down. He may be doing that with you in this season. I'm not sure, but I can tell you this. God wants me to use style. Excuse my son. God wants me to use style and stewardship to reach someone. Um, and that's not up to me how that looks, who that is. Um, and I have learned that um, God is so good that he will tell you again what he has already told you to do. And he will remind you in the most gracious way. So I just wanted to let you know, I will be coming back, obviously, because I'm just taking a season break. But that does not mean that I'm not going to pop in here and give you a little bit of an update via some encouragement on what I'm actually going through and how I hope that it can um, just encourage you, impact your life in some way and to remind you that I'm just another woman and I'm just walking this this earth, this, this Christian walk, just as you are. And we're all going to do that differently, right? In our own style for his glory. And I just want to remind you to do that every single day. Sometimes it's as simple as just recommitting yourself to Jesus every single day. And that is obviously in words and in deeds in what we do. So until next time, <laughs> um, I hope you are doing well, and I just wanted to remind you to get still enough to hear God's voice so you can steward what he's placed in your hands to the best of your ability to His for his glory. Um, so until next time, your life matters, what you do with it matters. So what will you steward well? Until next time.